Yo, it's me, Isotope from TRL, and welcome to the second solo let's play. Join me by your host, Isotope, with Sonic 3 and Knuckles. What we're going to do is 100% playthrough with Sonic and Tails, getting over Chaos Emeralds, the Super Emeralds, and let's try not to die. Well, I'll probably die once or twice, but you know. So, the game takes place after... Between, is it after Sonic 2 or after Sonic CD? I don't know, it's a bit of controversy with that. Anyway, there's a good age wire. Knuckles fucking hits you when you're supersonic. God knows how he beats out that form and he punches his iron and he's a twat. So, age wire zone at 1. The first level of the game is pretty easy. Uh, there's quite a lot of secrets in this game, and I absolutely love this game as well. It's the best Sonic game of all time. So you got Ring Monitor, Speed Boost, Rhino Bar, they try and charge at you. You can do Sonic's air shield thing when you press the action button twice and there's a ring, which you can go through the special stage. Now these ones you have to collect the blue spheres in order to get the chaos emblem. And if you go around the outline and some bunches of blue spheres you can get rings. If you get 50 rings, you'll get a continue. If you get 100, you'll get a life, I think. But, um, if someone knows that, or knows something different, they'll give you a burst. Uh, if you get all the rings, you'll get perfect, which gives you a 50,000 point bonus. I might talk for some of this, but usually I'll just probably concentrate, but I'll talk if I give any tips, secrets, or any random trivia about the game. Oh yeah, there was Angel Island, Aquan and two of his units for Smash Bros. Brawl. That's what comes to trivia. And you can also jump as well, so you can dodge the red spear. If you touch the red spear, that's pretty much you screw. And you need them to land it. So we've got a path there, and a first chaos in it. Which is green. Oh shit! Anyways. You've got your total score, the ring bonus, depending on how many rings you get, and the perfect if you get all of the rings. And every 50,000 points, you'll get a bonus life. And you might get a continuous round if you're lucky enough. But because the save feature, which was introduced in this game, continues are pretty much worthless. And if you have a buddy along with you, you can control his tails. And Tails can actually fly in this game, which makes it easy mode for this game. Oh, go on, mate. Oh, shit. And he just killed himself. This is pretty much a cutscene thing, but you can just hit me if you want. This game actually introduces mid bosses, which every act has a boss, even the act one stages has a mini boss, which you have to defeat in order to complete. And act two usually has the main bosses. Well, it has them for that case, I don't know why I'm saying that. Anyway, second special stage. I probably won't get all of the rings for all of these, but I'll do whatever I can. Oh yeah, just to mention, we were going to do the legendary versus Safari Zone in that pilot, but because the file wouldn't allow us to continue our save after we beat the game for some strange reason, we now therefore cannot do it. So, the final episode in the Pokemon League was actually the final episode of the Let's Play, our old Let's Play. And after this Let's Play, we will begin our fifth main series, which will be Majora's Mask, which I will be joined with Chadai and I'm McDaddis to play what's considered one of the hardest Let's um, not hardest Let's Plays, one of the hardest Let's Plays ever. Oh, yeah, this game. 
you can stay in this special stage for longer, the tempo starts to pick up a bit and you start to run faster. Biscuits can be explosive, don't touch him. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a music clip. Somehow it plays back to music while we're still in the first time. Lightning shield. Oh yeah, the elemental shields are introduced in this game. With the lightning shield, you press the action button twice to do a double attack, and you can get protected from electric attacks and some projectiles. The fire shield, you can press the action button twice to do a mid air flame dash, and it will allow you to deflect certain fire moves for most of them. This is the act one bar. Tails, be my epic slave and hit the goalpost. You can hit the goalpost until it hits the ground. Sometimes you might get hit in the boogies if they hit certain scrubs. But Sonic's face is on fire. If it was near his chest, it'd be Sonic in the secret rooms. I wonder that's where they got the idea concepts from. Okay, Angel Island at 2. I love how I just lost all that money. There you go. Meat spoon. Oh yeah, this chaos has been pink. And if you're playing Sonic and Tails in a special stage, Tails is useless. Because all you can do is jump, you can't change direction. But for some reason, you can't get affected by the um, red spheres if you walk into them. Unless you're playing as him in single player mode. Those white spheres with the red stars, they're bouncers, the bumpers. There's too many of those in Sonic 4. Hopefully episode 2 will be fit, so. And because I'm going to get this out of the way, I do like Sonic 4. I actually think it's pretty good for what it is. The only problem is, is the lack of originality except for the level They're cooking for more originality. The physics turn a little weird, but they're actually not as bad as loads of people actually think they are. I think they're pretty good. Well, it's not perfect, but it's not disastrous to the point where it's unplayable. But the, le the content is way too short as well. Oh yeah, remove all the, well not all the bumpers, but the majority of the bumps in the special stages are ridiculous. So yeah, back to Sonic. Oh yeah, the bubble shield. Press the action button twice to do the bubble jump. I depend on how, how long you hit the um, hold the bubble, the action button, you can go higher. There is one thing I would say there. They discovered that you used some lesbian vessel who lift a lot of things. Just some random outbursts. And yes, 
if you go in the water and lightning storm, it'll drown. Same with the fire storm. Oh shit. And you cannot drown whilst you've got the um, liquid shield on. And the extra one. Oh yeah, this one's dark blue. If I'm not talking, it's usually I'm concentrating. So the next time we play Circle of we're going to do Hydro City Zone. See you guys later.